Good dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting this video, I would like to say something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, then note it and proceed further. And although you have facing any problem or difficulties, please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you. Now here is the question. A cube of mass capital M starts at rest from point 1 at a height 4R where capital R is the radius of the circular track. The cube slides down the frictionless track and around the loop the force which the track exerts on the cube at point 2 is. Here we have given four options. Options are A 3mg, option B mg, option C 2mg, option D cube will not reach the point 2. This question is related to the laws of conservation of energy and centripetal force. Okay, and one thing very important whenever any object which is moving vertical circular motion, here the lowest point, the maximum velocity should require to complete circle is root 5 gr. And here the exactly half that is required 3 gr. And here that is required greater than gr. Okay. So this is the concept we have using in this question. First of all, we have using laws of conservation of energy at the point 1. Here total energy at point 1 is equal to total energy at point 2. Okay. So here we have find out the total energy here. What is uh, energy? It is this energy is accumulated due to the position means potential energy mg. And what is the height from the ground? That is 4r. And there is no any kinetic energy, so therefore 0. Okay. At the point 2 here, this point potential energy mg. And what is the height from the ground? That is r. And this is r. That is 2r. And uh, kinetic energy, because this uh, block moving and making the circular path. So therefore, that is certain kinetic energy is also possible. So mv square is it clear? So 4 mgr equal to 2 mgr plus 1 by 2 mv square. So here 4 mgr minus 2 mgr. Then transposing this term is equal to half mv square. That is 2 mgr equal to 1 by 2 mv square. Here m m cancel out 2 to the 4 gr equal to v square or it can be written as v square equal to 4 gr. So v is equal to 4 gr. It means 2 root gr. So therefore definitely here we get v is equal to 2 root gr, it means definitely this block reaches to the point 2. Is it clear? Now, now this block reaches at the point 2 and is stuck. It means there is no slacks or we can say that normal force is acting downward direction, mg acting downward direction. So therefore, equal to centripetal force, here centrifugal, centrifugal acting to the outward direction. Okay. So therefore, here normal force mg acting downward direction, this total forces is equal to centrifugal force mv square by r. Okay, now substitute the value of here v. What is the value of p equal to 2 uh, 4gr? Direct we have to substitute root. 4 gr and it's a square n plus mg. 
n plus mg equal to mr and 4 mg 4 gr so here r r cancel out 4 mg minus mg equal to here the normal force so here normal force we get 3 mg let's see which option is matching here option a we get 3 mg i hope so you understand this question thank you for staying till the end of this video definitely for your success all the credit goes to your hard work but if my video will help for your success then i will consider myself lucky thank you once again take care bye bye